for those who know me well, know that I'm not the smoothest talk, most smoothest talker out there, but I'm a very effective leader. It, for the first time in 25 years, Lee District has a representative as an officer on the Planning Commission. I'm an elected officer because my colleagues see that I'm an effective leader. Now, I've been doing that from day one, working for the community. If you care about certain issues in Lee District, I believe I'm the candidate for you. I have the background from the public and private sector that hit the ground running on day one. I've made this about Lee District. I haven't gone out looking for national endorsements. I haven't gone looking elsewhere. I've looked locally for civic activists who care about Lee District. If you care about the schools, Brad Center, former school board member, supports me. Liz McGann, Lee High School PTA president, supports me. Liz Murphy, who is fighting for equity in the schools, not just in Lee, count, Lee District, across the county. If you care about the environment, I have John, John Gagnon supporting me, Soil and Conservation Director from Lee District. I have Bob McLaren, former EQAC member, Lee District. If you care about civic activism, I have Erica Reynolds Clayton here supporting me. I have Linda Waller supporting me. I have Susie Warner supporting me. These are all Lee District people. They know the community, they know what needs to be done, and they know me. As elected officials, I have Delegate Mark Sickles, who has been Mr. Lee District for decades. He's supporting me. Our most progressive state senator, Adam Eben, supports me because they understand what I can bring to the table on day one. My compassion, leadership, and experience. I hope to earn your support between now and June 11th. If you want to find out more, jamesmilyatu.org. Thank you.